Welcome back to FDL. This is part three of the first run in Captain's Edition. I switched back to my old mic, as you may have seen in the Isaac video, uh, depending on which one comes up first, and also if you watched which one first. Anyway, I'm going to just begin. We are going into the fucking hyperdrive, whatever. I'm going to use the improved engines for additional fuel to go full speed. Yeah. A rebel ship has been patrolling this region. As soon as you arrive, it begins its assault. Oh, damn. All right. How are we going to handle this? I mean, I think we'll be fine. Uh-oh. Oh, it must be one of those repeater things. That's great. Oh, that did basically nothing. Nice. Oh, you got to be kidding me. They shoot down. Ugh. Ugh. That's, that's dreadful. That is just dreadful. They shoot down lasers? What is it, what does this country come to? I don't accept, I don't accept fucking surrender, especially whenever your drones do shit like shooting down lasers. That is disappointing and aggravating and just plain old dumb. Anyway, I'm gonna, I'm going to bombard you with light scatters until you die. Considering my fucking burst laser doesn't do shit. Oh, well. Maybe it does now. Maybe it does shit now. It doesn't. It's official. The light scatter doesn't do... The light scatter. The burst laser doesn't do shit. Another group of rebel officers meets their end by the hand of their prime target. They're their wreckage only further fueling your escape. Remember last time whenever I had severe trouble pronouncing that? Look at me now. I need to outfit my thing. Okay, let's see here. You are somewhat glad that some civilians made it off their disease-ridden worlds. Still, most of them indeed might spread the plague, and on top of that, like the crew of the ship, engage in piracy to survive. Transmit some scrap. Thank you, thank you. We are sorry, but we have no cho choice to resort to these kinds of measures. Okay, well, you're welcome, ass. I thought that would have turned them away from piracy. Oh, well. Uh, I don't... Disease samples... You write a scrap transfer order. The office is full of traders that want to strike last-minute deals and get out of the system. Loading the cargo takes a while. You check the ship equipment catalog while waiting. Uh, what's the subspace scanner do? Sensors even in... Ooh. 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 That's kind of cool. Uh... I'm gonna give up my requisition license for that, actually, because that... That's really cool. Oh, these guys want some scrap. I don't have any scrap. We don't want to do this, but you asked for it. Uh, yeah, no, they're not cloaking. Yeah, take take some of my power, please. Yeah, bitch, you can't cloak for shit. All right, uh, it took out our oxygen, really? Uh, I'm gonna put the slug into a trance. Oh, wait, no, you can't. I'm gonna put the AI into a trance. Is that an AI? I don't know. I, I'm, I'm surprised I was dumb enough, dumb enough to even attempt to put the slug into a trans thing. Those guys are busy battling it out. I might be able to... Okay, yeah, I'm taking these boys out. That Was that a Zoltan or an AI? I couldn't really tell. Ooh, fires, fires. I don't want this guy getting his, uh... Oh, his med base back online. No, you have... I don't care. There we go, yes! All hostiles aboard the ship have been eliminating. Entering the craft and salvaging from it holds a certain risk. The disease might spread. No, let's send in the crew. The away team manages to acquire control of the ship's door control and systematically vent every room of its hazardous atmosphere. They then proceed to strip the ship. And they unload, unload its fuel supply. Epic. Why am I paused? This dude's on fire. Oh, get out of there. Get into the med bay. Please. NG boy. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Do your thing. I'm going to upgrade the core. The reactor core a little bit. No, you, you stay back. I'll have the human deal with this. Also, I need to upgrade my doors. I need to... 
Ah, uh, I'm one away. I'm one scrap away from being able to upgrade my doors. Because as soon as I get blast doors, we're basically going to be... Uh, we're we're going to be border proof for the time being. Okay. You receive an emergency hail from a heavy decontamination ship. They are trying to retreat from battle with a local pirate. Be careful, Captain. These criminals carry the disease and have to be eliminated. Uh... They have cloaking? They don't have clo- oh, okay, I wasted it last time. Okay, well that's bull. I'm gonna have the Zoltan, because the Zoltan has better attack. Power. I'm, I'm playing some trickery over here. Watch this. Look at that, look at that. Look at that, I'm playing these guys for fools. Let's go, uh... They have, they have slug thing. Got him again, got him again. There's hole boost. Not hole boost, hole breach. What do you mean? What's a hole boost? Got rid of their Zoltan, hell yeah. Let's uh let's just mind control this dude. Just to screw with him. I don't accept surrender. How how can you surrender while you're mind controlled? Well, how does that even work? It feels kind of cruel to be doing that to him, mind controlling him and stuff, but at the same time, I mean, they asked for it. Also, we have level 2 blast doors now, thanks to the fact that we have uh, Sun over here managing the doors. Now they're level 3. A disabled Federation craft drifts near this beacon. Hello, Federation craft, do you read me? We've been ambushed by the rebels. I'm the only one left here. Life support is failing. May I come aboard? Yes, welcome aboard. You can't really be sure that this recruit is not infected, but for now, they seem all right. All right, Kate, you can go operate that. Now, uh, Kate, you're very red, and I'm not letting you be named Kate. That's a dumb name. Everybody knows Kate's a dumb name. Uh, I'm only half joking. You're red. Okay, I can't think of anything, and she kind of reminds me of Fiona from Shrek, so I'm going to name her Red Fiona from Shrek in parentheses. Uh... I feel like I could have there. There's I feel like there's a red character that would have been better suited, but mm, I can't think of any. Distress call from an old space station nearby. No one seems to be left alive aboard. You do not dare to check for the exact cause. Let's socialize. Actually, you know what? Uh, oh, gross! I'm gonna do a combat simulator. We are gonna simulate more aggressive ship combat. Welcome to Combat Scenario 271, the Kajiro Run. Your trade ship has been ambushed by pirates of the new Kajiro system. Evade their crafts till help arrives. Um, but yeah, okay, yeah. I'm, I'm going to cut back once the training's over with, because honestly, it's just a little boring. You successfully completed this evasion training session. The Combat Simulator will now evaluate your crew's performance. You, your crew scored average results in the scenario. You evaded a significant part of enemy, enemy fire, but still would have taken considerable damage in a real fight. Okay, well, that's ass. I need to upgrade my engines more if I want to actually avoid stuff. You reach another long-range beacon. Some kind of battle fleet must have come through here lately. The surrounding guard outposts are unresponsive and show no life signs. Lucky for you, the invaders left the relay intact. You'll have to decide where to go from here. You come across an asteroid mining colony. They message you immediately saying, Greetings! Our surprise of mining explosives have run out ever since the rebels blockaded the system. Do you have any extra explosives? Fifteen missiles! Wow, this will help our efforts considerably. Let me see what I have six grounds up to offer you. They deliver some scrap and have their team try and repair part of your hole. Quite epic. Uh, I appreciate that. I'm going to divert most of that into uh, mind control. Take some of that off of engines. Feels like AI-controlled sector, huh? Industrial sector. Ooh, I'm going to go industrial because... I wonder how an industrial nebula works. We're gonna have to use basic engines because we're running low on fuel. And, uh, sector scanner! Uh, ooh, okay, yeah, we're kinda... We're not doing too well here, we're not doing so hot. Uh, these guys wanna toll, well, yeah, you can toll my balls. They don't have any, uh, they don't have any cloaking. Uh, what? No, no! Ah, oh, shit! All right, Mr. NG, I'm relying on you. Uh, ooh, ooh, uh, son, son, get in there. Help my man's out. At the very least, we want to damage him. Uh, oh, ooh, that's a big ass. 
laser, laser, do your thing. Oh, we killed one of them. Do they have a clone bay? I don't, I don't even think they have a med bay. All right. Oh, got their captain. They offer you some car, some of their cargo if you let them live. Look at all that fuel. Uh, I'm gonna honor my truce. I'm an honorable fella. Avengers are picking up a distress call on an encrypted Federation channel. You eventually find a Federation scout being chased by a rebel fighter. Yeah, fuck these dudes. Uh, they can suck on my weenus. Uh, I'm gonna mind control their captain there. Man, they are really going to town on him. They must hate their captain. Damn. Oh, got him. That was that was a good hit, actually. And they all just killed each other. These guys really must hate each other, honestly. Got him. This okay. The lights. The light scatter is actually turning out to be pretty damn useful for taking people out. And I mean, you kind of forget how useful taking people out of from the ship can be. I mean, look at that. All right, this guy's gonna get mind controlled. This is hilarious. It is hilarious how well I'm doing right now. Not how well I'm doing in general, but against these guys, how well I'm doing. The enemy's engines begin to stutter. Your opponent navigated too hard and burnt out their stabilizers. Ha <laughs> ha! What a bunch of retards. We won, and then we helped them. I'm thinking I buy a teleporter and a clone bay. Yes, and then yes. Uh, the best bet I could, I, I feel like I could make at least. Cause I mean, I now I can, uh, I can send this boy and this girl, Red Fiona. Cause I forgot uh, we had, f <laughs> we had the Aperture Science Hollow turret working the cameras. So whoops. But we can have these two dudes get on attacking people while we also mind control them. Very, very useful. Oh, what's going on in here? It's all yellow like pee. The shields crackle as you jump into another deeply polluted part of the sector. Microparticles and pseudo-organic cooling sludge floats everywhere. You are looking at years of waste dumping. The stuff gather gathers at port windows. Who will clean this up? Oh, we can upgrade. Find a way to dedicate more power to your active augments. Hmm. Whoa, there's a bunch of stuff. I'm just gonna socialize. Mantis, give us another sun. The Mantis is staring out at the viewport. I know the system, Captain. Members of my clan come here to hunt. My kind still might still obey the traditions and render assistance. Let's contact them. You put your mantis on the comm and it sends a broadband hail in its native language. A small mantis ship approaches from the edge of the system. Your crewman seems to be superior to them. And after a short aggressive conversation, they offer you a slavish tribute. Okay. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's accept it. Your opponent jettisons the slave towards you in a pod and jumps away. You committed an act of slavery. See how the crew reacts? Several f crew members file formal complaints on how you handled this. <laughs> Boo. Boo-hoo. <laughs> That's all I have to say. I mean, wah-wah. Boo-hoo. File your formal complaints. Smog cloud. Dang. Oh, that's why it's a nebula. It's a nebula because smog cloud. Anyway, my point is, I mean, if all you're gonna do is go wham wham boo hoo, file formal complaints, then I'm not doing nothing. You gotta, you gotta, uh, fucking desert the mission if you want to send a message to me. There's nothing here save for clouds of acidic waste and dirty light emitted by a distant sun that is shimmering through them. Acid eats away at your ship's hull while you wait for the FTL to charge. Yeah. Apart from the corrosion hazard, this place is safe and quiet. You consider your options as it eats away your ship's hold. Uh, let's just get the fuck out of here. Damn. Oh, there's a hull breach. Mm, my favorite. Uh, send some boys in to get that fixed. Nothing here. There's stuff right there. All right. Uh, let's go to the next thing. I think that's very interesting. A polluted sector. Smog cloud. Uh oh. High particle concentration disable your sensors, but your first mate saw something in the haze. You move in as far as your clogged impulse drives allow and stumble upon a tech crate. Tagged 
Property of Waypoint Junta. Don't open. You take it on board and open it immediately. Targeting jammer. And it can disable one to two weapons. Oh, great. I'm out of fuel. Perfect. Oh, it's just a normal nebula. Yeah, okay. Uh, stress beacon's on. Let's go. A mobile slug fuel depot enter scanning range. My prices are fair, but I ask one thing. Do not insult me with negotiation. Five fuel for 50. I'm, an, I'm negotiating you, bitch. And yeah, no, you are not in any way gonna cloak on my watch. Anyway, uh, boop, bop, let's go. I'm gonna kick your ass. See you thought cloaking would work. Uh, can I, I don't have a life. Okay, well, I'm just gonna blindly fire upon engines and uh, then do that just to, nope, just to make sure, even though making sure didn't really get me anywhere. Uh, okay, you know what? I'm gonna take, since mind control doesn't really work, I'm gonna do that. Send these guys in there, see what we're looking at. Uh, uh, sacrifice, bam! And then, uh, do one of those. They're gonna get cloned, so it's all fine. Yeah, fuel! And also, two dudes coming back to life. So we're gonna have to wait for them to come back to life, so I'll cut to them. All right, they're back. Let's go to, I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna go to the next sector. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save the last stand for the final episode. Here we are, the Federation controlled sector. Wait a second, why is that red? We gotta travel at minimal FTL. Ooh, you arrive in a sector that is technically still under Federation control. Because the monumental rebel fleet is approaching, the Federation main base local forces will have to retreat soon or fight their last battles. Let's go. You transmit your security codes in a Federation comm assistant context you secured by audio only. This is Fed Command encrypted. We read you. Be advised that rebel forces are invading the sector. All Federation vessels up to encrypted rank are under our command in order to coordinate the evacuation. Oh, apparently your tags say are you free you you are freelancing level violet, meaning none of our orders are binding. Well, aren't you special? Seriously, we are in a tight spot here and need every ship we can get. Can you help us out somewhere? Give us a task. Go to stand by. Okay, proceed to the next crossroad beacon and join up with the fleet detachment encrypted. Receive further orders from its commanding officer. Engage any rebel forces you encounter on the way. Transmitting coordinates. Take care and good luck. You close the channel and we're gonna go fight some fucking rebels. This feels like a war. This actually feels like a war now. We were taking orders and shit. I'm loving this. Hello. Your communicator opens a hail from a nearby ship. Our weapon systems are malfunctioning and we're too afraid of pirates to travel home on a system. Can you escort us? Okay, that's another mission. Uh, okay, we can do that, right? And then we can do uh, that. Right? What else? Nothing else for now. We have two power slots left to use. Distress, and then we need to go to the quest so we can fight some people. Distress beacon time! The distress signal is sent by a small Federation orbital station. It seems completely deactivated and devoid of crew. Approach the station. You transmitted your docking protocols multiple times, but the section does not respond. You have to dock manually. All goes well, though. On board, you find little remaining atmosphere and a lot of dead crewmen. You are not sure what happened, but assume the, sta the station has been hacked or boarded by the rebels. You take any supplies that are left. I'm going to put it into these two and then upgrade Clone Bay for now. Gets the thing. Quest time. Quest one of two. Oh, there's a fleet. You arrived right in the middle of a major fleet battle. The beacon took heavy damage and can barely stabilize its jump circle. A senior Federation captain contacts you on secure audio channels. Free asset. We have lost general situation awareness. Engage target at your own discretion. Try to pick up the rebel lead cruiser and engage it. Yeah. All right, they have cloaking. So, uh, fuck that. Fuck your cloaking. You can eat my dick. All right, uh... Double that. Oh, Jesus. Get, go over there. Uh, what are we doing? What are we doing here? We are taking you out. And then we are sending these bros in. All right. Uh, okay. How are we doing this? See, you're not mind controlled right now. All right. Fire upon these boys. Uh, damn it. All right. We're... we're we are right now relying on these guys to get any jobs done at all. Uh, hold it, 50. Fuck. 
No, no, no. Oh, clone face back on. We need we need O2 up. O2 needs to come up. Oh, fuck my ass. Fuck my ass. We are we need the laser to come through. Any moment now. Come on, laser. Someone get in there. Oh, we are undergoing some heavy ass fire. Uh Clone base down. Ooh, they're fighting. No, I don't want to see that right now. We just need one more laser. If we can... Oh, can we just hold out for a little bit longer, please? Please. Yes, yes! We did it. That was so close. The lead ship fire, fires a final barrage before its FTL core detonates. The vessel is torn into two pieces, one smashing into the rear section of a nearby Federation cruiser. The rest of the rebels jump away one by one and the combat dies down. The battle group commander contacts you again. Well done! We've got them on the run for a change. We'll intercept them at Encrypted. Join up with us there again. They transmit the coordinates for your next engagement. After the fleet jumps out, you stay for a lot behind to correct, correct collect scrap. Nice. That was really intense, and I don't know if I want to do that again. Uh, I... If it wasn't for the anti-cloaking, we would have been royally fucked. So... Mm, that's nice. I don't. I can probably make. I, I think I'm gonna. I might have to abandon the mission unless I can stop by a shop first. These guys don't have cloaking. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's a. That's a. That's a big doo doo right there. Let's uh, you and then we'll send. We'll send some boys in there. As a distraction. Uh. Alrighty, alrighty. What, what are we looking at? What are we looking at? These guys are doing alright. Take everything we have and let's both forget this happened. No, you can suck on my wee wee. Uh, I'm not forgetting shit. Go kill these last dudes, please. And thank you. With the crew dead, you are able to take the fuel out of storage. You also take all the scrap you can manage. Fuck yeah. That's what I want to see. I don't know how we're managing to do this with only these two weapons. I mean, Lord. Lord I mean, and by Lord, I mean Lord knows that uh, we shouldn't be able to do this right now. We only have two weapons. Uh, the whole entire idea of this mod is that shitty strategies aren't supposed to be able to actually do well. You receive some trade offers from a nearby public shipyard. They are currently serve the remaining Federation main fleet in order to facilitate evacuation and request emergency repairs. You give your mission ID and some drones are sent out to work on your ship. You check what the outpost has to offer. Federation contraband. Buy some goods under... Oh, illegal under rebel laws. Well, I don't really care about that. Suppressive artillery. Suppressive means cooldowns by 7. Targeting radius is 45. Or suppressive ion blast. Nah... Light fire missile, boosterless combat, boosterless boarding. Oh, it takes time to get to the enemy ship. Then starts a massacre. Okay, well, I don't really care about that. I suppressive artillery laser seems nice, but I don't, I don't have enough stuff for it. I can also get suppressive ion blast, which is really cheap, and it requires one power. I'm gonna buy that alongside a repair and I'm gonna up oh I don't have enough to upgrade that's just dandy I'm, I don't think I'm gonna be able to make it to the next rebel battle they're gonna have to do, do it without me because I gotta go take on the fucking the main flagship you catch a glimpse of a strange signal coming from a space station before your sensors shut off unexpectedly you realize that this must be part of a boarding maneuver yeah the hostiles well you can all eat my wiener why are there a bunch of hostile dudes here uh, yeah, no, son, you get over there. Uh, mama, you also get over there. Uh oh, uh oh, uh, switch out. <laughs> Damn, we are not doing too hot. Uh, kill all the dudes though. I did kill all the dudes, right? The music, oh, the music's died down. It pains me. I really wish that that quest marker was anywhere else on the map. Ooh, here's a battle. 
You don't need an advanced sensor to tell that there's a battle going on. You look out of the windows quietly, waiting to jump. There's no way you can help in this fight. Yes, there fucking is! Yeah. No, there's no way I can help in this fight. Yeah, teleport your guys on there. Yeah, you bunch of idiots. Alright, oh, rock man, ugh. He can hold his own, he'll be fine. Alright, uh. Rock dude, get over there, ugh. He's almost dead, uh. What are we looking at? Everything's okay here? Ooh, I need to pause more often, uh. Yeah. Oh, damn it! Oh, well. There's no time to salvage all the wreck! The fleet is still nearby! Get ready to jump! And then we... We... we I'm gonna wait a second. There's no ASB or anything here to actually kill me, so... It's whatever. Uh, Dwayne, also known as Rockbutt, is up. Oh, Rockbutt is dying. So that sucks. Um, You come up now. I kind of wish I had a backup battery, but... I don't. I could have gone to that distress beacon. Now that I'm seeing it, I could have. That would have been nice at least. I couldn't do the uh, actual battle, but still. The local planetary economy is wealthy enough to maintain a long range relay. Permission to jump is still granted for remnants of the Federation. After arriving at the beacon, you detect a small one man shuttlecraft that says straight for you. Repeated hails real yield no response. We're gonna wait. It's just a rebel vessel. Oh, damn it! Fuck! Internal scans indicate that they teleported some advanced equipment. They are also deploying combat avatars to strengthen their numbers. Ah, oh, okay, well, you bunch of dicks. All right, we want to secure that clone bay. We really don't want them taking that out. Also, this little ass nut is going to die. Okay, he's not dying quick enough, so we're going to... Oh, it's a group of ass nuts. That's perfect. Where's the hole breach at? Oh, there's no hole breach. Hey. Ha, <laughs> they're suffocating. Oh, no. The Aperture Science Hollow Turret. HK923. You, you can take him on. Yeah. Good good on you, HK. Everybody back to stations. And then we uh, upgrade our sensors. We've had all that stuff maxed. Nice. And now, next episode, we go to the last stand. Our final battle.